Hello, hello to you, my friends. I want to show you um, a tiny flip through my latest junk journals. And let's start with this one. It's a very old hardcover book. And the love couple on the back and this on the front. So, uh, I used a lot of sari silk. And... I always try to keep some original pages of the old book. Um, you can find lots of tags here and here, old envelopes and, here, and original photographies and altered new tags and quotes. This is a little Tiny photo booth, photo booth. Come on, so oops, just have a so. and I have plenty space for journaling, but this is a very old paper and. Yeah, you can see those pockets are from you know, post stamp um, storage and I sewed them on this, um, what's this, um, transparent paper and included very old vintage postcards and more stuff and a letter paper and I stamped a little bit and yes and you have pockets and, and I saw oh this is from the marker I, I made a little tutorial or how to use the marker and this is what comes out but I learned in the comments comments that this marker is very expensive in US so it costs about $25 here in Austria mostly it's more expensive than in USA but this is different the opposite and so I would recommend to make to take a water brush you know those brushes you can fill up with water they have a little tank and when you fill in nail polish remover you will get the same effect and I made a little tutorial how, how to do that those this is an old ephemera card but the script is wonderful I love this old script and some tucks you know tickets and, and an old postcard and this is a, a um, train ticket from Vienna and this is from a friendship book from 1897 or so and look at this wonderful script I'm not sure if those are friendship books you know you have those albums at school and and each of your friends um, has a page to to keep the memory of him and this also is very old paper i got it i got my my vintage embellishments and and stuff from Vienna's flea market so it's really original and I sewed on this vintage envelope and the card and this old postcard I sent it down so you can use it again for some notes or or shopping list and this is to open like so and it's a bag and inside you have more stuff but I want to I want to be 
little bit faster because I have some more, but they are similar. This is a, um, um, a school. Um, oh, Zeugnis. Mm. Google, please help me. Zeugnis, just, just, just a moment, please. Uh, testy, testy, testy. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Zeugnis means testimony. Okay, from school. I, I hope this is, you understand it. From 1937. And I cut it in half. And so you have two parts of it. And of course you can take out and those tickets and use them. And old book pages. And I added an old altered film strip. I showed this in a tutorial. And I used some washi tape, those glassine bags. I love them. They are so beautiful. Handsome guys for you. This was a newspaper, and this is from 1907. Sew down an envelope and another card. You can see it here. You can flip and write on it. And this is a DR slide. And oops, this again sewed on some stuff for. Oh, this is from 1904. It's so wonderful. I love this a lot. And I have some more pages of this album. And you will see it in other journals as well. So, this was the first one. And this is a little envelope and ephemera. Ah, no matter. It doesn't matter. I'll close it later and here you can take the stamp out and back and of course here is another envelope and of course something inside and this is it this was the first one and oh yes I have to tell you this means kindness kindness so and I got it from my friend Patty Cozy from South Africa. And this is the second one. I love those old book covers and I didn't want to alter it because it's so beautiful. Look at this. So I couldn't make it better, but worse. And so I kept it like it was. Yeah, but I used Sari silk again. And, you know, original ephemera, some quotes and sayings. You haven't seen this. And this is a washi tape. And so it goes on. Like the other one, newspaper, a postcard, empty one. You can use it. Ledger paper. I love ledger paper. About the movies. And some pockets and tucks, angels, a quote, and transparent paper, and a little bit lace here. No, not lace, sorry, silk here and there. And this is the bag I showed you in a tutorial. I sewed, sewed it on and ripped off, teared off the, the book part. So you can write on this bag. And this, this is done with the, the uh, marker, acetone marker. And so is silk, ledger paper, tucks and pockets. A little picture image. This is another envelope. 
and all of those have two signatures. Dear slide attack. This is a very old vintage <coughs> sorry envelope. And I did not alter it. It's not tea dyed or coffee dyed, it's only very old. Wonderful. No? I love it. I love it a lot. Come on. Go back. So, okay. And you have lots of writing space. This is another pocket from, from post stamp storage. And some, they are empty. This is a little altered post stamp because not every stamp is beautiful and so we can alter them. Some tickets and tags and a little pocket washi old book uh, pages and images another um, pocket with vintage photo. This is Tim Holtz butterfly. Oh, they are so beautiful. And some writing space in a book page. This is the old paper. I use it up, but it's very old and, and not white, but not brown, but a little bit colored, like beige. And you can find tickets, and this is a little bookmark. Flip up. This is another page from this. I have two of those um, friendship albums. It's wonderful. From the early 90s. And photography, and another card with flowers and this beauty and this is it so this is the second one the third one is similar it has brown color and it's very I love these colors it's it's so sturdy and fine and wonderful and this is the dragonfly book isn't this beautiful? I love them so much. There you have this book belongs to, and this is from 1943. And you can see the little car and some, you know, packs again. Oops, it's a little, little bit too big and Behind this you can find some ephemera and this has also the same this is a little library card. It has almost the same, it's the same style as the other two. Ledger paper, sorry silk, post stamps. This is so funny to make. I like post stamps a lot. There is the other part of the testimony. Old, um, it's an old paper. And this is from my friend Miyuki. She gifted to me this paper. It's very nice. It's French paper. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. This was so funny. So I had to to add it in this journal.
pretty woman and an old postcard, a little tag, another tag, and here angels and a tag, a little bookmark from film strips, vintage ephemera, uh, shown on envelope, this is a marker product, and a shown on card, and of course inside you can find more ephemera. And some writing spots here and here, and another acetate bag from post stamps, vintage ephemera, vintage images, crinkly paper, tickets, a little bit of lace. Some stamping story. This is a little tuck. Ledger paper. The other part of the wrinkly transparent paper. Handsome boy. Tickets. And this is. This envelope was so old that it didn't, uh, the, the, the glue didn't hold anymore. So you can open it completely. And there I have, this is also from my friend Miyuki, Wien Apple Pie, check her channel. <laughs> so I sewed it on and this holds properly. And another image, Tim Holtz, paper dolls and photo booth, yes, and this is another postcard and another bookmark. And on the last page I have this image from Pinkfest, another dragonfly because I love them so much. And a very very old envelope and this wonderful tree i love this postcard so this is it um, those three have the same style and then i have another one huge one so this is really huge i'll zoom out a little bit a little bit sorry so i have to and this has a tag here. I used lots of lace and and um, this this is from India sari silk and lace. And this is from a book. It's hard covered and it has four signatures. So it's very huge and has of course lots and lots of vintage ephemera tickets and you know everything you need book pages birds vintage book pages here slide and this old picture from an old book friend chip book car um pages from 1895 wonderful descript I have to show you again descript from 1903 wonderful I love it oh sorry and this is from the marker you know the acetone marker English page this is wrapping paper, very beautiful. A little bookmark, baggy, a card with lace, and another 
on pocket from post stamp storage. I have plenty of those card in the middle and some money if you want to travel after the virus pandemia. And this one, yes, several tags and stuff. Who are you? Oh, I forgot to glue this. I'll fix it after the video. I'll fix it. And ticket with old script from an old letter book. And birds again. Wonderful ladies. And this book has tabs with a slot and I pulled lace um sorry silk through and sewed on a button. And this is from 1892 original script. This is rice paper. Rice paper here and there. Um, an envelope to flip to the right, flip it back. This was the first signature, the second signature again. Oh, can you see this little sparrow? I love them so much. And a quote, and this is an old kind of envelope. You can open it and you have a written, hidden writing space spot. And fancy grasses. This is an original um, book from a bank. Tag. So it's a tax board paper. So this is really huge and thick and has so much stuff. And just a quick flip. This is so beautiful, French book, and again birds and old clothes. This is a tuck spot from magic paper. This, my friend Miyuki gifted this to me. And when you, this is from a photo album, a page, when you flip this up, you can write down here something and flip up the whole thing because I sewed it on. You can see behind, behind, under, uh, you know what I mean. This is filled up with tickets, tickets. This is a glassine bag, vintage one. And, of course, you have a tag in this. It's an altered playing card. Some lovely script. A little letter. And, yes, it's not so... You know, lots of papers. And ephemera, this is from 1937, old postcard, a camping, um, pen, uh, um, yes, card, tickets, bookmark, and ephemera, postcard. And this is one of those pages from 1902. 
writing on this, and journal on this. So you have one not sewn in. Now come so sew down in on. I don't know, and you can take her out, put it back. And a tiny envelope in this, of course, with the content. And so it goes on, and another page from this old photo album from my friend and Grammy and Granddad. In here, so, and of course, you can. Flip this up and down and the other one from 1904 wonderful so wonderful script because I thought maybe you do not want to have shown it on or in another envelope and old postcard And bags, ephemera, you know. Oh, this is a post stamp. A little bit huge, but it's really a post stamp, actually. So. And this is very thin paper. And the other part of the camping thing, tiny envelope, insurance insurance agency from 1911, a little bag, paper clip bag, and this is an envelope. Okay, so this is a huge envelope, um, um, top loaded and old postcard. Maybe this side in. Okay, and here I sewed on, sewed on some old handkerchief and made a side pocket. And this is the calendar from 2020. So, and this is the bag. And then you can take out this. Okay, so this is it. The spine has buttons and sorry silk. And this is it. And you can find all of those in my Etsy shop and you're very welcome and please stay healthy and be creative. Thank you for watching and bye bye.